the 2022 Coral Scottish Grand National is underway. Four miles, 27 fences, one more flurry, strong economy, cool mix. Sharico Vallis amongst the early leaders with history of fashion and uh, vintage clouds. The first colours of Trevor Hemmings as they reach fence number one. All getting over it safely. Prime Venture and the Wolf towards the back. Uh, Ryan Manny has lost an iron on the Ferry Master towards the rear. He's doing his best to get it back before the next obstacle. Oscar Honeybee is also towards the rear along with Win My Wings and Innis Free Lad as it's to take over in the back straight for the first time. And one more flurry and Sharico Vallis, court master on the outside. Major Dundee just in behind with Cool Mix and uh, Via Dolorosa. Vintage Clouds is running in seventh place ahead of Stormy Judge. The darker grey maroon jacket running on the outside of Fantastic Ass. Ashtown Lad is then racing on the outside of Hill 16. The pink and black, one of two runners for Sandy Thompson. El Paso Wood is next in the field, just running in advance of History of Fashion. And Fiddix, dark blue, Ask a Honeybee out wider. And then Kitty's Light and Win My Wings, the Christian Williams pair almost side by side. In his free lad, the Wolf, Prime Venture. And the back marker is Strong Economy as they turn into the home straight, having jumped five of the 27. And Richie McLernan and Sharico Vallis leading one more flurry. And Charlie Todd won the novice handicap on this card last year, getting over the first of four in the home straight. Cool Mix is just following. And uh, Alan Doyle made a slight mistake at that one. And Strong Economy was slow in rear and is struggling at this very early stage. One more flurry. Sharico Vallis via Dolorosa and last year's winning jockey Tom Scudamore in between Cool Mix and uh, Court Master. Major Dundee for Alan King running in sixth position. A vintage Cloud's just losing a few spots. Ask a Honeybee is making some ground as they jump what will be the last in two circuits time. Still sitting in midfield at the moment is Stormy Judge with Fantastic Ass Hill 16. Two circuits to go. Ashtown Lad on the outside. Then Vintage Clouds, a shade out pace perhaps with Fiddix and History of Fashion and El Paso Wood. And following El Paso Wood is Win My Wings and Kitty's Light in no hurry at the moment. Then the Ferry Master Prime Venture, the Wolf. Innis Free Lad and Strong Economy is at the back marker of the 22 remaining as they've now completed a circuit and still two more to go as it is at Sharico Vallis and one more flurry ask a honeybee and uh, Connor Brace out wider with uh, Via Dolorosa in the next position in fourth ahead of Cool Mix and Stormy Judge Court Master Ashtown Lad getting a, a very good view out wide still in midfield is at Hill 16 as they get over this the first fence in the back straight now, they will be going around the open ditch. They won't be jumping the ditch, so continuing. And they won't be jumping the plane fence after that either. So the next two obstacles will be omitted. So just one more to take on the back straight this time around. One more flurry and Sharico Vallis ahead of Aska Honeybee, Via Dolorosa, Courtmaster and Cool Mix. And then Hill 16 and Jack Andrews, Major Dundee under Tom Cannon. Next in the field with Harry Skelton in the black on Ashtown Lad on the outside, followed then by Win My Wings and Stormy Judge. And Stormy Judge did make a slight mistake at that. Then History of Fashion, the two Irish challengers trained by Pat Fahey as they've jumped that latest obstacle and are now turning left-handed back towards home once again. Still well over a circuit to go in the 2022 Coral Scottish Grand National. Sharico Vallis, one more flurry, and Ask a Honey Bee are the first three. It's then two and a half lengths back to Via Dolorosa, Court Master, Richard Patrick on the outer of Hill 16, and Cool Mix, Fantastic as Major Dundee, Ashtown Lad, and Stormy Judge, the next quartet as they run towards the first of four in the home straight. Then Win My Wings ahead of Fiddix and History of Fashion. El Paso Wood is well back as Ask a Honeybee rises first that time. A peck from Sharico Vallis coming towards the next one in the home straight. And we've got a couple pulling up at the back. Strong Economy and Vintage Clouds has also been eased out of the race. So two more to take before they head out on a final circuit. Ask a Honeybee, one more flurry, a little untidy. Then Sharico Vallis and Via Dolorosa. 
Court Master, the orange and black, Ashtown Lad and Major Dundee. Hill 16, Cool Mix has lost a few spots as Fergal O'Brien's Asker Honeybee leads with a circuit to go. Coming up towards the line, one more time they head around and it is Asker Honeybee to Sharico Vallis. One more flurry, Ashtown Lad much closer in fourth. Via Dolorosa, Court Master ridden along. Then Major Dundee, win my wings. The yellow sleeves and cap making a, a little move on the outside. Hill 16 is holding his position at the moment, followed by Fantasticas and El Paso Wood, Fidux. And then Stormy Judge, still well back in the field, is Kitty's Light and with Innisfree Lad towards the rear with History of Fashion, Prime Venture and the Ferry Master. The Wolf is also still in rear. Reasonably well bunched considering how many of them there are as they come towards the first fence in the back straight. And once again, they'll only be taking three of the five down here. It's Asuka Honeybee to one more flurry and Ashtown Lad, a big jump from Ashtown Lad at that one. He was uh, quite beautiful at it. He's, he's followed by Court Master, win my wings, just improving on the outside of the field. Coming towards the next, Asuka Honeybee to Ashtown Lad in second, then Via Dolorosa, Sharico Vallis ridden, one more flurry is losing positions. Win my wings, the outside with Major Dundee, still fairly prominent. The Ferry Master tries to creep into it. Fidux, a cool mix has lost places. A history of fashion is driven at the back as they now run towards what will be the fifth last fence. And it's Asuka Honeybee to Ashtown Lad and Via Dolorosa. Major Dundee is in fourth. Hill 16 off the bridle. Win my wings the outside. Fidux still trying to improve. Fantastic ass is pushed along. The uh, Ferry Master making a little bit of ground. Stormy Judge is under pressure with Prime Venture trying to pick off a few rivals. They've got four left to jump, and it's Asuka Honeybee that leads Ashtown Lad and Win My Wings. She goes well, the Ida winner under Rob James on the outside of Major Dundee, who's also still traveling nicely. Fidux is in fifth, Major Dundee's stablemate, then Hill 16, and Kitty's Light also staying on now. So Asuka Honeybee about to be pounced on by Win My Wings, Ashtown Lad, and Major Dundee, and Win My Wings has come there going ever so well inside the last half half mile and she takes over their win my wings as Oscar Honeybee fell and it's win my wings coming to the third last has jumped it well and is now opening up a clear advantage over Ashtown Lad, Major Dundee and stablemate Kitty's Light but it's win my wings race to lose over the second last, she's clear by about 10 lengths, her stablemate Kitty's Light is running into second place but win my wings he's not supposed to win Scottish Nationals like this, she's taken it apart Kitty's Light in second, and she's going to win it hard held. This is extraordinary, this mare. Win my wings, the Ida winner, and Rob James has got all the time he wants to salute the crowd. A tremendous winner, win my wings, of the Coral Scottish Grand National. Two in second position, Kitty's Light. A 1-2 for the stable, then Major Dundee, clear of Fiddix. A 1-2 for Christian Williams, and a 3-4 for Alan King.